So the Patriot Front Group is at it again. I've been seeing this on Twitter, and this has been a whole bunch of middle-aged palm color men just saying that it's a psyop and it's the feds trying to make them look bad and make them the enemy. Is it y'all gaslighting? Or y'all really unaware of what y'all have done in world history? Celebrated and taught it in the school system of what y'all did to people. Crusades? King Leopold took out so many people that it actually created climate change. Multiple world wars? American slavery? Mass incarceration? That was actually authored by our current sitting president, and the biggest DA from that is actually our current sitting vice president, the 94 crime bill. Like, this is y'all. This is what y'all do. And no, we're going to get on here, y'all going to say not all of us. And that goes the same thing for every other people. It's just that other people are always highlighted because y'all control the news and the narrative. Everybody got bad family members. Latin community with the cartels. Our community with the gangs. Italian community with the mob. Y'all community with the three Ks. And police. And government. And now this group. Deceptive for what it is. Most are so high strung about it. We even see Elon Musk on Twitter talking about something they're trying to make it look bad. Like, bro, you come from apartheid era, South Africa. Family on the mind. Helping these people use technology for straight up digital control. I'm not understanding what's the problem here that y'all dirty laundry is finally on the clothes line in front of the whole neighborhood. He had to deal with it for decades. Hey, I gotta do the same thing now that the internet is having free news, freedom of press. So y'all get shown just as much as us. It's not a specific attack on y'all. Everybody just seeing the world for what it is. We had to deal with it, now y'all gotta deal with it. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Also subscribe to my YouTube, the link is in the bio, where we discuss crypto, tech, finance, world news. See you guys tomorrow.